Hey, Abiding Presence, we are a community of faith in a new way. So, you've made your reservation. There's a video about that that you can take a look. And you've decided that you want to come to church to worship in person. And there's a video about how to get from the parking lot to the pew. And whenever you arrive here, after parking your car and coming forward, there's going to be a worship support team member here to check your reservation and instruct you to enter in. And you make your way through the double wooden doors right here. You're going to remain six feet apart from each other. You're going to be wearing a face mask for you and everyone in your family over the age of 10. Now what? Well, this video, we're going to talk about where we're going to sit, how we're going to practice safe measures, and what worship will look like from the pew. So come on in. Inside the Narthex lobby, you're going to find another worship support team member who's going to usher you to your seat and give you all of your worship materials, and they'll actually have extra face masks for you if you don't have one. Now, where you sit will determine which door you're going to enter into the sanctuary, and you will be ushered to seat on the outside sections of each pew every other row. The worship support team member will guide you into the sanctuary and lead you to the next available pew that has been cleaned and prepared for worship. Now cleaning happens between each service by a paid cleaning service to keep the worship service disinfected. Now I know some of you are pretty uh, solid Lutherans that have your favorite pew. Uh, this may be hard to deal with, so please understand that the seating arrangement has been established to provide enough space for all to worship safely, so you might not be sitting in your favorite pew. You and your family are going to be encouraged to sit together, and if you have a large family, that's fine. You may take up the entire pew for your family. Children, they're going to be seated with families. The nursery is not going to be available during this first phase of worship life, to, life together and if you look in the back you can see that all the cushions and the pew boosters they're also not out right now uh, they're not going to be available but there will be a children's bulletin that'll be given to your child as well as crayons for them to take home with them after worship let's go in and see what it's like inside the seats when you arrive at your pew, we ask that you have a seat and that you stay there for the remainder of the worship experience. The pews themselves actually look a lot different. You can see that all the Bibles and the hymnals and all the papers have been removed from the pew backs as a safety measure. Now, during the worship service itself, passing of the peace and communion, these are going to be done, but they're going to be done from where you are located. We're not going to have time to wander around to shake hands, to give hugs, or, or standing in line to go up for communion during worship. This is going to feel different. And we're going to talk more about passing of the peace and offering and communion in another video that's coming soon. We will have children's sermons, though, but we're going to ask that your children remain with you in the pews for them to participate where they are. At the conclusion of worship, we ask that you stay in your pew until a worship support team member arrives and they're going to usher you out in a safe fashion. This way you can leave safely. We can all stay six feet apart from each other. And as you exit, we ask that you return to your vehicles because during this phase of worship, there will not be opportunities for fellowship or to have breakfast and Sunday school will be conducted online. So it is going to feel and look different, but we are a community of faith in a new way. For those that are unable to come or for those that are just not ready to come back to worship, we continue our online worship and this too is going to look and feel different. Look for another video to come in the, in the days ahead for new ways to worship online. You, my friends, are the abiding presence of Christ in the world and together we are seeking God and serving others in new ways. We'll see you real soon.